there, everybody. Welcome back to Sussex Farm. Simon Lundergaard here. I just got done taking care of the cows there. Got them all squared away. Got some power food made. Uh, now I'm going to go down and just take care of the sheep there real quick. And then we're going to head off to Nicholson Farmstead there. I made a phone call down there this morning. And they got everything set up for us. Yes, they have a load of pigs for us to pick up. So we got to do that there. And then um, get some piggy food and get that back to the farm. But we'll do that here in just a little bit. Uh, good old Marge, she is out still planting corn there. She's on number five now. So she is uh, working hard there to get that corn in the ground. Once you get done with that there, all I have left to do then is the uh, soybeans. But I get them done maybe even today yet there. Cause Marge, I tell you what, she, uh, she goes hard there. She really, really does. Come on sheep there. No, you don't come after me sheep. You gotta go the other way there buddy. Okie dokie then. Good old sheep, I tell you, I love these sheep. Yep, I do. Holy buckets, I hit a, I hit a bump there. No sheep, stay away there sheep. Look out there sheep. Oh, get by real fast there. I don't want to hurt those sheep. I don't think I got anything there. Here I am trying to help out the sheep there and I don't do a very good job. Oh. I must have pushed it right back in there. Okay, that's okay then. We're good to go there. Let's see, let's check on the wool here. I think I got a pallet of wool that can be sold here. Oh boy, I'm getting some wool. I gotta get that taken care of there too. Uh, we'll do that, uh, we'll do that next time there. Let's get, uh, get this tractor back up to the farm. I'm gonna get into my van there. We'll head down and check on Marge. See how she's going on field number five there. And then uh, we'll head down to Nicholson Farmstead Pig and Feed, and uh, we'll check on the piggies and uh, load up some uh, some piggy food. I think what I'm going to have to do there is go down to uh, to uh, Lundegaard Red Crop there and grab a truck and get a flatbed truck there, and then bring the uh, piggy food back on that thing. I think that might be an idea. Uh, might be a good idea there, and we'll get the piggy food brought up here first, then. Then we'll have to go back down there and get the pigs. But I think that's a good plan there. Let me see. Where's my van? Probably in front of my house there where I left it last time. Might be a good uh, good plan there. Tell you what, it is an absolute dandy day here in Sussex. Uh, second day of summer. Just uh, 140. Whoa, summer. Hold on there, buddy. 146 in the afternoon there. We're a uh, pretty, pretty good day. Yeah, sun shining, clear skies. No rain in the forecast there. So that's going to be good with getting that... Uh, that corn in the ground there. That might work out pretty good. I know the uh, soil temperatures aren't quite uh, high or warm enough as we want them, but uh, we'll be okay there. I think we can make that work. So let's just head up here to field number five there, and we'll just uh, run by Marge, see how she's doing. Just to know that, just so she knows that I'm thinking about her. That's kind of all that, uh, that's kind of how that works there, you know. You just do a little drive-by, and then she knows, oh, that's Selmer, he's out looking for me. Well, I wouldn't say looking for me, but you know what I mean there. Looking after me, checking up on me, making sure everything's okay there. So let's just see. I think she started here, there. Oh, there she is down there. Okay, so she's still going. Well, we'll just go back that way there. That'll work there. There she is. Fine, fine, outstanding farmer woman there, Marge. Okay. So everything is still good here, so that's good. Get that corn in the ground there, that'll be a good thing. So now we'll head up to uh, Lundegaard Root Crop here, and we'll get the uh, truck and um, head down to uh, Nicholson Farmstead Pig and Feed and get that loaded up there. I'm just thinking we're just probably going to get just a bunch of pig food for the start. I, I know uh, it could be just a little expensive there, but I tell you what there, uh, Nicholson Farmstead Pig and Feed, they got a special. So they're going to treat us pretty good there, so I don't think we're going to do too bad on that. I think, uh, I think that'll be a good plan there. Just see here, I want to go this way there. To Lundegaard Wood Crop there. So we'll head that way. I wonder where they're going to finish this construction project here. It's been going on kind of a long time. Here we go. We'll just pull in here. Get the gate open there. We're just going to borrow a truck. And then, uh, well, I, I'll, tell you, I'll tell you what, I wonder if we should, uh, boy, you know what I'm thinking there? 
why don't we use the uh, flatbed there? That might work out pretty good there. Otherwise, I'd have to take off the payloader and the uh, Raybot thing. I could do that too there. It's either that or I go take the truck there and go back up to the farm and get the flatbed. That might actually work better, I think, there. That might work pretty good. We'll do that there. Yeah, I'll just drop off the forest one here, and uh, we'll go up to the farm and pick up the, uh... Whoa! The side of the building there. We'll just drop this one off, and then we'll go and get the uh, flatbed up at the... Whoa! There for the roof there. Don't get too carried away there, Selmer. There we go. I can stay down there, you know. You don't need it. You don't need to pull it back up there. Okie dokie then. So we'll take this. Go back up there to the farm. And we'll get the flatbed one. I should have had that one down here, but I, I kind of left it up there at the farm. Um, that's kind of my bad. But not too far. We'll just cruise up there and get that. And then head down to Nicholson Farmstead Pig and Feed. That's a nice place down there, I tell you. Yeah, they done some remodeling down there. Got things kind of built up. They got a... Uh, you can uh, buy and sell manure down there. You can uh, buy and sell slurry there. Uh, they got a nice little pig lot back there with some feed. And Oh, yeah, they got a nice place. Nice, good stuff down there, I tell you. Good stuff. Yep. And one of these fancy-dancy roundabouts here, I tell you. I get a little dizzy going around these things sometime there. Not quite used to them yet, even though I've been here for quite a while there. But that's okay. That's okay. Boy, look at that oil seed rape there. That's some fine looking crop there, I tell you. I like it when it gets like that, all nice and yellow. Pretty snazzy. Wish they'd come get this car out of there. It's been parked there for quite a while, and uh, maybe I should just tow it out of the way. I, I can't believe they haven't come got it yet there. They don't know what that car's doing there, but uh, can't be good there. First time I saw now, I thought it was just kids there parking, but uh, it's been there for quite a while now, and that's not good there. Okay, let's just hook up to the, uh, the flatbed here. I should be able to get a good amount of pig food on here, I think. I think that'll work out there pretty good. Oops, there, Selmer. Got to kind of get lined up there, Selmer. You're getting a little, a little carried away there, buddy. There we go. We'll just put that on there. Yeah, I'll load that with pig food. That'll be easy there. And then I can put it back there by the hay storage thing. That'll work out pretty snazzy. I can get quite a few pallets on there. They got pallets and bags down there at Nicholson Farmstead Pig and Feed. So I don't know which one we'll go with. Maybe we'll just go with the mixture there. Maybe that'll be the way to go. But I'll tell you what there. Uh, let's see. Which way should I go down there? Let's go back down this way now. Watch out for traffic here. Traffic has been bad lately. I tell you, they got to put a stoplight up here, I think. Hope get into that car there. There we go. Not too shabby. That'll work out pretty good. Oops, stay off the curb there, Selmer. Well, I'll tell you what there. Uh, we'll see down there in just a little bit. Almost there. Just kind of coming down this road across the uh, the other road there. It will be there in a second there. Not too shabby of a drive. I tell you what, it is a beautiful day. Absolutely beautiful day here in Sussex. I am loving every minute of it. Yep, you betcha. I, uh, oh, there's Selmer. Hold on there, buddy. Oh, there. Putting a new bus stop there on the corner, I see. Well, that's just dandy. That's not too bad. Um, haven't been down there this way lately. But, uh, yeah, no, pretty snazzy. A nice crop there. Good crop there. 
right in here on the left there. We'll just turn into here there. Let's see. Dandy of a place. Oh, gates are open there. Oh boy, dandy of a place there. Let's see. Um, the C T point over here. So you know what they told me there? Uh, because I bought 38, uh, 38 cows or cows. I didn't buy any cows. 38 pigs there. I can get a good deal. And they kind of threw in some pig food. So we're gonna gonna pick this up here. Let's see. I'm just gonna kind of back into here a little bit there. Without trying to hit any of their stuff there. These are nice people down here, I tell you. Dandy of people. So let's see, we'll just we'll just park right about in here. That'll be pretty good there. Yep. Oh. Yeah. Oh boy, beautiful beautiful down here, dare I tell you. Yeah, they oh they got a lot of pig food there. I think we'll probably take uh four pallets and four bags there and we'll put down here but that'll work out pretty good let's go check on our pigs there I think they're up here around the corner Nicholson he said you just you just help yourself to whatever you need there Selmer uh, yep do pretty good there oh yeah are the pigs all loaded up here let's just see oh they got the door open in their truck there I don't see do you see any pigs in there hello pigs Oh yeah, they're in there. They're all ready to go. I can see them if I jump real high there. Oh yeah. Oh, good looking pigs. Oh, they're stuffed in there like pigs. Oh yeah, that that's some good stuff there. Splendid. Okay, that's ready to go there. Um, and then we can uh, get the pig food up there, come back there, and we'll get the uh, the pigs, and we'll head up to the farm there. Boy, beautiful place down here. This is just lovely. I like this. Okie dokie. Then he said, you go ahead and take the tractor there and you can load up your stuff if you want there. So, let's see. We'll take the uh, forklift here and we'll get the pallets on there first. Yep. Like I say, they're nice people there. They just say, yeah, you, you do whatever you need to do there, Selmer. They're, they're busy with other operations. So, he said, I, I know you. You're a good farmer there. You can, uh, you can just get it yourself there. Kind of on the honor system, you know, there. Yep. Boy, I see. I gotta get a closer look there. Make sure I don't uh, don't screw anything up here. Oh, the wrong way there, Selmer. Holy buckets. I gotta be careful with their stuff here. I certainly don't want to break it the first time I use it. They would never let me come back down here. But uh, that, that should work there. Close enough there. Close enough. We'll just get it on the truck here and that'll be okay. Whoa, boy. Easy does it there, Selmer. Easy does it. Oh, careful all the way there. I got to get used to the controls here. Kind of a little different than in my in my front loader there. I'm kind of used to doing that there, but that's okay. I'll get the hang of it there. There we go. There's one that'll work out pretty pretty dandy. Let's see. We'll take another good one here. We'll go over here in the corner and take this one there. Kind of looks like nobody has a, a certain way of, of uh, doing this. They just pick one and take one. There we go. Oh, that worked out pretty easy. That was a good one. I'm getting hang of this, I tell you. I could, I, could, I could get a job here being a forklift operator. Marge wouldn't think so, but I, I think I could do it.
Ooh, I hear sirens. The uh, police must be after somebody there. Not good in there. Okay, we're all loaded up with some pig food. We got that. Let's see. We'll uh, strap her down there. There we go. Fire the truck up there. Oh, yeah. We all good to go here? Oh, yeah. All good to go, dear. Oh, that looks nice. That looks just dandy. Yeah, nice place down here. Okie dokie, then. Uh, we'll head back up here to uh, the farm. We'll get this unloaded. And uh, we can carry on there. Then we'll come back. I'll come back in the van there. And uh, we'll pick up the pigs. And we can bring them up to the... Uh, to the farm and get them unloaded. Oh yes, this is going to be splendid, I tell you. I'm, I'm, I'm excited. I really, really am excited. We'll go this way this time. Um, I already had my turn signal on there, but then I turned it off. But we'll go up this way. Uh, check out the sights here just a little bit there. Lovely. I don't need any gas. Nope. Nope. Don't need any gas. Okie dokie then. But we'll see you back up there at the farm and uh, we can carry on. So far so good there. I tell you what, this truck is a dandy. This truck is a dandy. You betcha. Um, get the pig food there. Get back up to the farm. And we'll get this unloaded. And put some in the trough there and make sure it's all filled up there. Put some water in the uh, trough as well. Then we have to go back down there and get the piggies. So that should be, uh, should work out pretty good there, I think. Not too shabby. And get some pigs on the farm there. You know, like I always say, I'm a big fan of bacon, so... I like, I like pigs. I, I really do. I like pigs a lot there. Yeah. No. I, I, I did, I did call down to uh, Arvid down there at the salvage yard. And I was asking him about these uh, fancy little um, fork thingies. You know, not fork thingies, but little grabby thingies there. To pick up these bags there. He said he can whip one up for me. So, we'll have to head down there and, uh, and pick up that there. Because that, that's going to work out there pretty slick with these uh, bag food thing, these uh, pig food bags. So, the pallets, you know, the pallets I can do there. I, I got the forks for that, but these uh, bag things there. So, I think we'll just go down there and pick that up there real quick. Um, you know what I think? I think it'll be just as easy just to take it right off the truck here. Um, I'll probably park here in the middle there so I can get on both sides. Let's see. Yeah, that'll work out right there. That'll be pretty good there, right there. Unbuckle the strap there. So, now, I'll go find the tractor there. And we'll get this unloaded there. Holy buckets, I got a big head there. I should trim that down there and put a little gate there. Otherwise, I got to walk all the way around here. But uh, we'll get the tractor and we'll head down to Arvids and pick up that little, uh, I think they call it a bail grab there. But we'll pick that up and uh, everything's, all, everything's pretty good there. Got a phone call from Marge there. She said she's all done. So she's going to head back up here this way. That uh, five, field number five there, that's all planted with corn. So that's pretty good. I think we're doing okay there. One field to go. Got the soybeans in there. I said, you, you March, you come back. You have some lunch. I can go down there after I finish up the pig stuff and, uh, and whip up that soybean field real quick there. So she's all excited about that. She thought that would be a good idea, you know. She has a DVR, her soap opera there, so she hasn't seen that yet today. So she'll have to um, catch up on that at lunchtime. But that's pretty good for her there. You know... Marge, she likes she likes those soap opera things. I, I don't know. I'm just not a big fan of them there. I, I just don't get it. It's like, you know, sometimes I'll sit down with Marge at lunch there and she's watching her soap opera, so I kind of pay attention there. And then about a year later, same thing happens. I have lunch with Marge. I sit down and it's like I never missed anything. Nope. It's like I never miss anything for the whole year there. So, unless somebody dies there, of course, but then they, they kind of replay that over and over again. So, that's not too shabby, but uh, yeah, no, she likes those soap opera thing there. I don't know. Never, I never got into it. Too busy farming, you know. I'm too busy farming. I don't have time for soap opera. Oh, I missed Arvin's place. Holy buckets. Get back up here. I, I was too busy thinking about soap operas. I went right by Arvin's salvage yard there. Let's see. Oh, there they are. He got them all, all set up for me there. He said he had a pair that he just kind of um, got fixed up. And... Uh, See if I can get hooked up to them there. And he said, I'll throw I'll throw a quick uh, can of spray paint on there. So he did that. Boy, they look nice. Oh, boy, I tell you that, Arvid, he is uh, he's a talented guy there. He can really fix up anything there. But, oh, yeah, that'll, that'll, that'll be splendid. That'll be a lot nicer than picking up those bag things. So that worked out pretty good there. But let's see. Get back to the farm. We'll get the pig food unloaded there, put away into the, into the little shed there. And then we'll get that... Um, 
filled up with water in pig food. And then we'll have to head back down there to the Nicholson Farmstead Pig and Feed. And we'll pick up the uh, piggies that are waiting in the trailer there. 38 of those piggies. We're going to have a lot of bacon on the farm. You can never have too much bacon on the farm, though, I tell you. that. Nope, never have too much bacon on the farm. Boy, that thing worked out pretty darn slick there, I tell you. That is a dandy of a thing. I'm sure glad Arvid found that for me. Boy, that would that make life pretty easy there. I think what I'm going to do, though, is I'm going to head back over here. I think I'm going to put a rear weight on the tractor here. I got a little bit top-heavy there. The back wheels started coming off the ground there, so we're going to put on a, a rear weight real quick. I think I have one over here. Um, let me get the rest of that unloaded there. Boy, that's going to be dandy. That is going to be a dandy thing there. Especially with their specials. I tell you what, you can't beat their prices over there at Nicholson Farmstead Pig and Feed. That is a dandy of a place. I'm a big fan of that there. Sure, I'm glad they opened up down there. That, that's, uh, that's a pretty splendid thing there. Let's see, where is it? I think I had a rear weight here. Oh yeah, there it is. Yep. Just to be on the safe side there, you know. Selmer, I don't need to go for, I don't need to go into the hospital anytime soon, so and I don't the back tires came off the ground there. I got just a little bit worried about it. So we'll just be better safe than sorry. You know what they say? Better safe than sorry? Yeah. So we'll get that hooked up there. Get back, get the pig food unloaded. I don't know how much the pigs are gonna require right away there, but uh you know we do have some stuff in storage too, so I can uh, supplement the pig food with some of the crops that we have in storage. I'll take a look here when we get back there and see what we got. I think we have some. I don't know if we have any corn there or not, but uh, that's kind of why Nicholson Farmstead Pig and Feed there, they said that, well, we'll get you some good deal on some pig food there if you don't have any corn because, you know, those piggies, they like a lot of corn there. And uh, I get the piggies fed real well, then that just means more bacon. So it's kind of a win-win situation for me, I think, there. Let's see. Let's see if I can get this lined up there. Oh, that's not working real well there, Summer. There we go. That's better. Oh, yeah, that, that that rear weight there. That works a lot better. Yeah, back tires don't come off the ground there. Well, we'll get this unloaded there. Uh, just take me a little bit. You know what the problem is there I have. I'm, I'm concentrating too much there that I can't talk at the same time. So, you know, when you get to be my age there, you just kind of got to concentrate on one thing at a time there. It's like even though, you know, I have a hard time eating and talking on the phone at the same time. Yeah, I can't do that as well. Um, driving tractor talking, no, that doesn't work for me either. I have all kinds of problems with that. But uh, we'll get all this unloaded, and we'll get some into the pig, and then we have to go down and get the... Uh, the water container there and I'll have to go put the bale forks the the uh, pallet forks on there to uh, get the pallets off there but uh, yeah no it's all good this is working out pretty darn snazzy I tell you okay okay I got uh, I put one pallet in there I'm gonna put a second one in there uh, and then we'll go get the piggies there yeah it didn't quite add up too much there but I think you know what I'm gonna do is uh, put some other crops in there too you know, uh, Nichols and Farmstead, they called me and told me that um, they're working on their pig silo. So they're going to have a uh, it all grounded up into bulk there, you know, and uh, put into a big silo. So I can just take a trailer over there sometime and get some pig food there that way. But they haven't quite got that done yet there. So we'll just have to go with this for now. Um, but that's okay. I, I, I like doing it. I like doing it there. That That's pretty nifty. I, I, I like that a lot there. So we'll fill that up there. Yep, took the whole thing there. So, um, let's see. Now I got to uh, go get the water container there. I got to drop off the weight here. And then we'll take the truck. We'll take the truck back down to uh, Lundegaard uh, Root Crop. Get my van. Head over back over to um, Nicholson Farmstead Pig and Feed. And then we'll get the piggies and bring them back home. And then we'll see what time it gets to be. Then I'll probably go out and start planting soybeans there in the big field uh, 26, 27, I think, there. Yeah, that's kind of the plan. A lot going on, though. Boy, I tell you what, you know what? Every day for me is just one busy day, I tell you. 
I, 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 know, I don't have time to relax. If I'm not doing my own work there, I gotta do everybody else's work, so. But that's okay. I'm, I'm thankful that March came out today and uh, was able to get some corn planted for me. That worked out pretty good there. Um, email, he's supposed to come out mowing here, so we'll see if that little boy shows up there and get some mowing in, because then I want to get some uh, some bales made and some silage made too there, so. Um, what happened to my water container? What did I do with my water container is gone? Oh yeah, I forgot there. What am I thinking? It's up by the cows. Oh boy, I tell ya. Sometimes I think I'm losing my mind there, but then I remember, oh yeah, I brought it up there by the cows there. So, that's where it's at. God, who in the world would come down here and steal a little water tanker? Especially an ugly colored one like that there, but, um, nope. It's right there. That's where I put it. Hello, cows. Oh, those are fine looking cows there, aren't they? Yes, dandy cows. Cows, pigs, and sheep now. Pretty darn close there. Hell, can't forget about the chickens too, there. Can't forget about the chickens. We'll just top that off. Okie dokie then. That's all we need there. So now we'll go fill this up here. Without running into the hedge. And then we'll top off the piggies. And then we can bring them home. Mama, I'm coming home with the piggies. You betcha. I like that song there. Yep. No, I was a big, big fan. Big, big fan. How could he not like Ozzy Osbourne there? The guy can't say, can't talk straight, but when he's singing, he sounds clear as day. I don't get it. I don't get it there. Not a big fan of bat eating either, though. I'm, I'm not, I, I don't want to eat any bats, but uh, he must like them. But that's okay. Tweets their own there. Let's see. Oh, didn't quite make that corner there, Selmer. Gotta take a deep breath there, Summer. You're getting a little carried away here. So, I'm gonna put this here. I'll fill up the trough here. And then I'll just leave it here because I'm sure when we get the piggies here, we'll need to put some more water in there. Yeah, that was only 700 liters or so there. So, we'll drop that there. Okay, that is good to go there. I think I'll put the tractor back over here in case I need to add some more pig food in there. How's they look happy? Then we'll have to check on the straw for the piggies as well, dear. Yeah, we'll just put this right here just like that. That'll work pretty good, dear. I'm going to go down, drop off the truck there, and then pick up my van. And I'll meet you back over there at uh, Nicholson Farmstead. Sounds like a good plan, there. We'll see ya in just a little bit. Okay there, see you later guys. Have a good one. I was just stopping in the office there and uh, talking to them a little bit there. Their delivery driver, he is out today. Ooh, watch out for this little pothole here. Ooh, careful there. I, their delivery driver's out today, so I, I told them I could I could take it up there. I'm pretty good at that. Ooh, what's this? Ooh. I could take it up there. I'm a professional truck driver. I can do that. So we're going to hop in here and take up our uh, 38 pigs there. Ooh. Very nice. Let's see. Get that door shut there. There we go. Fire the truck up there. Oh, splendid. Good sound in truck, I tell you. Good sound in truck. Oh, look at that. Double-decker pigs up there. Look at that. Very nice. I like it. I like it. Okie dokie then. We'll get the pigs up to the farm. Get them unloaded. Then I suppose we'll have to get them water and uh, feed and straw and all that jazz, you know what I mean there? Get all that taken care of. That's a big load. 38 pigs there in one load, that, that's a good load there. I don't know, down the road we'll have to try to get some more pigs maybe. Uh, I like pigs, of course, you know, I like bacon, so pigs come with bacon. Um, so yeah, that should be okay there. Anybody at the bus stop? What the bus schedule say? Bus transfer. Line six. Okay, very nice. Very nice. I'm going to drop that little car here. We'll go straight this time. Yep, there we go. 
Okie dokie then. Uh, I'll take the pigs up to the farm there. Ooh, look at that. Another big plane coming going. Oh, stay on the road there, Summer. People, people are traveling. People are busy, I tell you. Lots of people coming and going. But uh, I'll see you back up there at the farm here in a little bit. We'll get these uh, nice looking pigs. Nice looking pigs unloaded. And uh, we'll carry on with the rest of our day. They're quite a big rig there, but we made it up here to the farm there. No problems. I didn't even hit anybody, believe it or not there. No, no, no accidents. No problemos there. But uh, we'll get this truck there back into the pig there and we'll get them unloaded. Let's see. What will be the best way of doing this here? Well, we have to come through here, I think, there. To come through here. We'll come back down over here, there. Swing around this way, there. I think we unload the pigs right in here in this corner here. I think right out there. Let's see. Let me just get out here and take a take a look here. I think right about. Nope, not that there. Let's see. I tell you what, been a while since I've been. Oh, right in here maybe. No, that can't be right there. Oh, right in here. Okay, we'll unload them right in here then. I can I can get in there. I can back up in there. No problem. You just watch Silver do it here. Keep in mind there. I'm a professional there. Oh. Maybe not there. Gotta kinda get over that way. And then I once again that mirror is just worthless there. There we go, that looks better there. No problem there for summer to do that. Okie dokie then. Let's see how we did. Oh, not too shabby there. Perfect. That'll work there. Let's see. Now we gotta do is, uh, well I could have been over it a little bit, but that's okay. We're gonna unload a piggy. Unload piggy. Where you at there, piggy? Here, piggy, piggy, piggy. Oh, there he is. Fine, fine looking pig out there. Okay. Now, but now I, I gotta, just like the cows, just kidding. You gotta come back here now. I think that's how that worked there. We're going to load that piggy back up there. Okay. There we go. Now we can unload the piggies. Unload. Put down 38 of them in there. There we go. 38 piggies. Look at that there. Oh, there's some fine looking pigs. Oh, that's some good bacon there, I tell you. Hello, piggy. Boy, you look tasty. Yes, you do. I suppose you need some stuff there, though. Oh boy, all kinds of piggies walking around here. Outstanding piggies. I like it. I like it a lot there. I like it a lot. I suppose they need some stuff there. Let's just double check here. Oh boy, look at that. Um, yeah, they need some water there. They need some corn, some wheat, barley. Could, oh boy, they need the whole works there. Okay, well, we'll have to get on that there. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. I'm going to bring back this trailer here. I'm going to bring that back to uh, Nicholson Farmstead there, the uh, pig and feed, and then I will pick up my van, and I will be back here in just a little bit there. And we'll get the pig sorted out, and then probably see if we can get some corn or some soybeans in the ground there. Kind of like a pretty good darn plan to me there. We will see you there just a little bit. I'm just down here admiring the bacon. Yep, oh, oh, pigs. I should call them pigs, not bacon. But yes, I did. I, I tell you what, I like pigs. I like pigs. I know you may not make a lot of money on pigs there, but but I tell you what there, I like them. I, I really, really do there. So let's see. I'm going to get that water container. Uh, Got to get them some water and probably put out another pallet of piggy food there. And that should be okay for now. Um, and then I got to get the cedar going, and we'll get some soybeans in the ground there. Marge, she brought it back here. She's inside having lunch there, um, watching her soap opera there. So that's okay. So we'll put another pallet in there. Whoa, easy, Summer. Oh, jeez. There we go, dear. When uh, Nicholson Farmstead pick and feed there, when they get their bulk uh, silos hooked up, I'll have to go down there and get a trailer load probably there. That might be okay. Or I feel like I can look at my silo here to see what I got there, but I don't think I have any corn. I know I don't have any corn. Um, 
So that's kind of the, uh, the wrench in my plan here. But that's, this is okay here. I, I like doing this, you know. I, it make, kind of makes you feel like you're doing some real farming there. But we'll just dump this off here. Oh, there it goes. Get it in the truck here. Let's see if that make any changes there. No, not really. Oh, jeez. Let's see. Let me look at my trough here and see what I got there. Um, do I have... Oh, boy! Where did I get all that corn from there? I got 23,000 liters of corn there. Huh. I'll be darn. I didn't know that. Okay. Well, you think I should pay more attention to what I got in my own silos there, wouldn't you? So we can do a little bit of that there, too. Um, I'll just give them some water here and there. Top that off for them. There we go. That didn't take too much. Okie dokie, then. Um, hmm. Boy, I tell you what, though. I thought those big bags of pig food would go a little bit longer, but they don't quite do that there. But, uh, I think, um, let's see. They'll be okay. No, I better do that now, there. I'll give them some corn here. I didn't think I had any there. You know, next time I'll, I'll know that I should probably pay more attention to what I have in my silo there before I go and do all that there. But I like to have I like to have pig food there. Uh, we'll just do this for one time here, and then next time I'll go get some bulk pig food there. But uh, I wanted to try the palace there. Nicholson Farmstead say you told me that if you uh, if you buy 38 pigs there, we'll uh, we'll do a good bargain for you. Won't cost you much money. So that's what kind of they did there. They kind of threw in the pig food there. So you can't beat that deal. So we'll just put some corn in here. I didn't think I had any corn. I wonder where that corn came from. That must have come from the previous year there. That should be okay there. We'll dump this off there and see how that goes. Too much big work today. I don't know if I'll get back in there to get my, uh, the soybeans planted, but I can probably get that started there, I think. There you go, pigs. Add some corn there. Nope, maybe not. Huh. My trailer there doesn't want to unload there. Huh. What the world is going on here, dear? Oops, on the truck there. I'll have to get this figured out there. I wonder what's going on here. Got it all figured out there. Boy, that's a, that's a tight fit there. That uh, trailer wasn't working quite right there, but that should be okay there. Uh, I'm going to do the rest here uh, a little bit later, but they got some corn there. Let's just see how good that looks there. Go back over here to the piggy stuff. Oh, yeah, wheat party. Yeah. Oh, no. I suppose I could do that now real quick there. I'll do that real quick there. I'll put some uh, some uh, wheat and uh, canola in there, I suppose. Oh, rook crop. Oh, yeah, that's what I was doing. I don't have my rook crop there down at the uh, storage. I'll have to go down there and bring some up there. Well, let's see here now. What should I do? Um, canola there. We got just a little bit of that. We'll just use that up there. Um, yeah, I'll have to go down to Lundegaard rook crop there and... Uh, and pick up a load of uh, sugar beets there, I suppose. But then again, why would I do that, though? Because because uh, Nicholson Farmstead Pig and Feed there said I could come get a bulk load of, load of uh, pig food. So, it, yeah, I will just wait on that. Maybe tomorrow there I can get down there and, and get a load there. That should work. This is kind of a crazy little thing they got here. It doesn't quite uh, work real right unless you're kind of right up there on the drop there. There we go. Okie dokie, then. There we go. Now we'll just put in there, uh, we'll put in some wheat in there, barley, and we should be okay to go there.
Oh, 285 there. It can't be. That must be a misprint. You can't have, uh, you can't have, um, sugar beets in our silo. They're, they're just, look at that there. 4,000 liters of pig food there. I got all kinds of stuff in here that I didn't realize I had, but the sugar beet, that's not right there. You can't put sugar beets in a silo there. That must be a misprint there. But, um, my, uh, my, uh, fancy little, uh, silo app there, kind of goofy, I think, there. Not getting the numbers right, because that can't be right there. But, um... Okay, that takes care of that there. Pigs are good to go. Well, I'd go down there and get some sugar beets, but, uh... I think I'm gonna wait for them to get their pig food silo up, and then I'll get some hauled up in here to my silo. Um, I didn't realize I had already had their 4,000 in there. I didn't. Uh, I didn't realize that, but that's good to know there. So we're okay with that for now. That'll be good. Um, I think it's time to go get some soybeans in the ground here before the night comes. Uh, maybe I can even get it done yet today. There. We'll just have to wait and see how that goes. But animals are good there. Uh, all the corn is in the ground, and all we have left there is a soybean, so if I can get that done this evening, that'll, that'll be a good thing there. And then next time, I'll probably have to get some spraying done, I think. Um, that's be kind of on the agenda there. But let's just get the tractor parked up here, and we'll head down to that soybean field there, if I can get the uh, planter all full. But yeah, that worked out pretty good there. I really am a big fan of that Nicholson Farmstead Pig and Feed there. I like that place. I'm going to go there more often, I think. Hopefully, maybe they'll expand their business there and we can uh, we can do some more things with them. That that would just be dandy there. Oh, don't. There we go. All kinds of fancy buttons here. I don't know what's going on there. There we go. Now we'll get that closed. Okay, now, now, we're, now we're off. Now we're off like a herd of turtles there. No, I don't want you open. You can close again there. Good job. Okie dokie then. And we'll head down here. And soybeans, yep, we got it all figured out. Got it all selected there. Got the soybean discs in the planter. We're ready to go. I'll get this planting done then. So so uh, this, mo this tractor, I like to put on the mowers there. So that's kind of what we're uh, waiting for the mowing there. For this tractor to be... Um, able to use for the mowing there but it oh boy it's dirty there i tell you what usually marge there she's pretty clean but holy bucket there she got this trucker all filthy but that's okay though i that's what would you expect in a tractor there it's a tractor that's what his job is there to uh do field work and get dirty right absolutely there Our nice big, it's going to be a soybean field there. Yeah, we're going to try this. We're going to try soybeans here in Sussex and see how it goes there. Not a lot of, not a lot of folks uh, grow soybeans, but but we're going to give it a shot. We're going to see how it goes here. And uh, we'll see if they're any successful or not there. Like I say, the soil temperature needs to warm up a little bit, but uh, we don't have much of a choice there. we got to get this stuff in the ground. But, uh, yeah, you betcha. Well, that seems to be working pretty nice there. I like this planter there. You know what? Some people tell me, Selmer, you got to get a bigger planter. But no, no, I don't think so. This one works just fine. I like it. It's uh, easy to use, and and I and I know how it works. You know, you know, not those those big stuff. You know, they're all kind of kind of big and fancy, and I, I don't know how to operate them. So so I like this one. It takes me just a little bit longer to get some field work done, but you know what? There, I like it. It works out pretty snazzy for me. And I'm a big fan of it, so I'm gonna keep it for a while. I think there, there's no need, there's no need to replace it. But I'll tell you what, there, I'm gonna work on this field for the rest of the day. There, it's just gonna be kind of a lot of back and forth here, not 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 too exciting stuff. But um, but yeah, we'll get this finished up there, and then uh, like I say, next time we'll have to get some uh, some spraying done. I think some some fertilization, or no, not fertilization, some. Uh, Get some herbicide down there, maybe even a fungicide application there. That'll be good there. Uh, keep taking care of our uh, our animals. Got to keep up on that. Now that we got all the animals there, you know, we're gonna be we're gonna be busy. We're we're gonna be some busy farmers here with the crops and all three animals. But you know what, there, that's okay. I like that. 
I like I like that. I think that'll work out pretty darn good there. And uh, like I say, we got milk and bacon. You know, milk and bacon there, and, and and chicken. So we have eggs. That that's a hearty breakfast right there. That's all you need: some milk and eggs and bacon. So, so we're we're sitting pretty good there. But I'll tell you what, there we'll leave it there for today. Thanks for stopping in. Thanks for joining me on my little uh, the perils of Selmer Lundegaard. I appreciate that. And if you like the video there, give us a like there. That'd be kind of dandy. And if you haven't subscribed yet, do that as well. That would be very nice. But um, from the beautiful, beautiful early summer day here in Sussex, Summer Lundergard telling you, have yourself a great day. And we'll see you later. Mm -hmm.